basically the bus just uh, turns Why? left. So I figured it was going to go this way, but to be honest, this feels like a tight turning for a bus to do. I know, but I can just it. Lots of people's around anyway, so it doesn't make a difference. What if I just hold it against the glass? Just like, leave it up there. There. Just waste me with the glass. I guess. Yeah, that, that. <laughs> I think you have to hold it. <laughs> yeah, I think, I think that's the best idea. No, I can just hold it like this. And hold it at the top so that it doesn't fall off. But do you need to get one? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that yeah, is right. Well, it probably would be quicker, but then I'm not considering how long it actually takes to get around. Because you have to. You have to actually stop at the station, then you yeah, have to walk and then, back. Like, how much extra would that be? For or you could yeah. walk through here, which I do sometimes when I take the 316 for Kilby. 316? The 316 goes here. It terminates here. Yeah, it got extended. Side. Sorry, but it, it got extended from Cricklewood to um, Brinkhurst West. Yeah. It was only oh. until recently that I actually realised that they were going to reroute the 189. Well, actually, not really re... I can't really use the word reroute because it's still going its normal route and I can't really use the word divert because it's this is its new way it's going to go, but it's basically just I mean, supposed to... reroute is like... Reroute, thank you, yeah, that's... Yeah, I think that's probably the best way of putting it. Um, right, so actually, yeah. you know what, now I want to see what actually happens. Did you just... Were you here on the opening day? Yeah. Yeah, I was, I was. Yeah, December 10th. Yeah, yeah I think, and then they, um, shortly before that, obviously, they rerouted the um, 316. Yeah. Um, unfortunately, I was an hour early before the mayor came. <laughs> I had a friend. Oh, like, yeah, I, I went to there. meet my fr I went to meet my friends here, and then one of my friends. It was so funny. He walked. They were interviewing them there, and he walked right in front of the camera. <laughs> it's a bit, it's a bit weird. I know it was so funny and so embarrassing. I think that's supposed to be the terminating. Wait, so it doesn't terminate here. It turns oh, around. Yeah, no, I mean not to terminate. Sorry, the align point for the three one six for it to come back round. No, the three one six is on the other track. I think it's the three two six. Oh, from top from Tottenham oh. Hill. Oh. I think. Wait. Oh. I mean, oh, it's cool. done. That, that, yeah, that is cool. Like that it just uses that to turn back. So basically. Basically, just do it, and so that obviously it just extends yeah. the route. Extends the route, and then just goes back yeah. to Claremont Way. So it takes a slight. I can't say a slight detour, but it, it takes a detour. Yeah, a certain detour. Yeah. Yeah. I was here this morning as well because I take this bus to get to school as well. Oh right. Okay. You know what my favourite thing about the station? What? The public overbridge, so that I can, you, I could take the three one six back. Oh, I see. Oh, they both come, Alex. They both come in both. Look, yeah. That one. Yeah, I know. I noticed that, which I think is really kind of funny because you've got. I didn't think they were going to turn around. I thought that was a through route. Really. That's what I thought, but then when I saw that, basically, you just basically kind of do a loop around Brent Cross um, West Station just to come back to, um, back from, as a connection point between Clifton House Road South and Claremont Way. I read from, um, from a website that after this entire project is finished, there will, there will be some sort of bridge that connects to Templehof Avenue and then they will withdraw the Claremont Way to Maple Down School. And Wait. Park. That seems a little. <laughs> yeah, I know. Well, to be honest, I'm saying pointless from Cricklewood Station to Brentcross Shopping Centre. This route basically just mirrors the C11 anyhow, so if they just increase the frequency of the C11, it shouldn't really make a massive difference. And then from Caney Mews to the shopping centre, 
you've got the 102, so, so if you need a double decker, I guess that would kind of, it still kind of, kind of balances out, if you would. So essentially, that's like a five minute detour. That's literally what I, hang on. Why is my phone's brightness so low? It takes approximately five minutes, this. Yeah, five minutes and 46 seconds. Now the 102 behind's caught up. Clement way. And now we're here. And yeah, that's basically the Brain Cross West um, <laughs> detour. Thanks for watching. Oh, and yeah, and this is also being filmed while chatting to some two other um, transport enthusiasts, which are UK Transport 2, do we see you and then do you have a YouTube channel? Sorry? Do you have a YouTube channel? Oh, uh, yeah, I do. It's Casey, this is Casey Francis. Casey, what's sorry? Casey Francis. Casey Francis, so I'll leave links to their channels in the description. Thanks for watching. <laughs>